And Matthew is threatening one of the biggest college football games of the season. K-Rod here now with new information that fans need to hear. And K-Rod, this is a storm that could interrupt plans for a lot of folks on so many different levels. Oh, absolutely. A lot of games in Florida already are being canceled, postponed. I'm not a Fox 5 storm team meteorologist, but I'm playing one on TV right now. And this is a look at what the Georgia-South Carolina game is up against off of my shoulder here as it lies somewhat in the path of Hurricane Matthew. Thanks to Jeff Hill, who's a Real meteorologists for making this awesome graphic for us. The game scheduled for Saturday night. So will they play the game or not? The University of South Carolina says it's continuing to monitor the movement. They'll make a decision sometime later this week. South Carolina Governor Nikki Haley says she can't imagine the game being played. It's a complete decision based on the schools, but I... You know, as of now, I can't imagine that happening. Look, I would love nothing more than to see this just suddenly, you know, take a right-hand turn and go out to sea. But, you know, as it looks right now, we're looking at Friday night into Saturday. Again, a decision expected to be made in the next couple of days. So far, the game is on. Tom? All right, we'll wait and see. K-Rod, thanks. Be sure to stay with Fox 5 for updates on Hurricane Matthew. Chief Meteorologist David Chanley and the entire Fox 5 Storm team are working hard to keep you updated on the huge storm's track as it approaches the southeast. You can find the very latest information both here on the air and online at foxhurricane.com, myfoxhurricane.com, that should say. Or you can download the free Fox 5 Storm Team Weather app to have updates sent straight to your smartphones.